what if there was a way for you to compare the performance of your Facebook page with other pages of similar size? Guess what? Yes, there is. There is a free tool, and we're gonna talk about that in today's video. Before we jump into it, you know what to do. Subscribe, hit the bell icon, and also like this video. All right, now, let's jump right into this. Um, the tool that I wanna show you in this video is, let's jump to Agora Pulse. So yes, Agora Pulse is known for social media management. This is a tool you would use to schedule your content, post on like multiple social media channels, create different queues, and also manage all of your communication in one place. It's a very powerful tool. But they have this free tool which I have fallen in love with recently, and it allows you to compare the performance of your Facebook page with other pages of similar size. You can see, you know how sometimes we're getting organic reach or let's say paid reach or engagement, but is it good or bad? Is it better than other pages of the same size? How do we know? Well, this tool is gonna help you uh, see that. So basically, agorapulse.com, uh, you're gonna go to the free tools, and they do have a bunch of them. The one we're gonna focus on is right here, the Facebook page one, it's the analytics. Uh, click on try it, and I believe I'm already logged in. So here, here I am, I'm already, already logged in, but let me actually just open the, uh, a separate tab, and I wanna show you, you're able to see how they do their analytics, how do they do their uh, data, the, the performance measurement. So for example, I'm gonna go to a free tool, and then let, uh, let's go back here. Here you go, so you're basically comparing your Facebook page. Uh, you'll have to kinda connect your Facebook page to this tool, which I have already done. Um, and here are different things you will learn, you know, insights, compare yourself to your competition, and optimize your organic reach, right? Uh, what, you, what I wanna show you is this thing right here. So this is how this tool works. So if you want, you can read through this. They basically look at the, your last uh, 50 posts and then do a comparison with all the other pages in their database. All right, so uh, it's at the bottom of the page. Now let's go back. I wanna show you, I have a couple of pages already attached. Uh, and here is, so for her, uh, here's one of my pages, right? And now here's the, this page's insights, post insights, compared to 61,000 other pages. Here's something interesting. So instead of comparing, and I found that useful too, instead of comparing with all the pages, because you don't know, some pages might be 100 fans uh, or followers, and your page might be 10,000. So you can change it to, or select something that's more uh, relevant or equal to your page, right? So for example, you know, you can, from this drop down, you can do that. And then look at this data. This is what I love about, this is so, so simple. And obviously, you have to take into consideration a lot of different things. For example, on some of our pages, like last month was um, the Black Friday or Black November. So we were running a lot of promotional campaigns. When you run a lot of promotional campaigns, guess what happens? The organic reach could go down, right? So you gotta take into those consideration, uh, those things into considerations, because some of the things, some of your strategy that you're doing on your Facebook page, other pages may not be doing it, right? So, but anyways, going back to this data, this is very, very powerful, because I can see on this page right here, we're doing a really good job with engagement, uh, and then the people talking about this, but our reach is low, right? So our organic reach is low, so we could post more content, you know, to increase the organic reach, and obviously we're not running any ads right now, so th that's that's true. But in like very simple, in just a couple of minutes, I can get a feel of the performance of this page compared to other pages of you know similar nature and similar size. Very powerful tool, and obviously, like I mentioned, um, this data is based on the last 50 posts, which is right here. Uh, do take into consideration any strategy, anything special that you're doing on your pages which other pages may not be doing it. For example, you know, sometimes, let's say your page's ad budget is $5 per day, and you're competing it with someone who has $500 per day ad budget, then, you know, it doesn't make sense, right? Then, obviously, the numbers are not gonna make sense. So, you gotta take into uh, those things, you gotta remember those things. And then here's the, you know, you can, in a graph too, you can see your uh, monthly organic reach for, last, let's say, 30 days, you can change it to 90 days and then you can see the comparison, uh, the uh, 
the gray is everything in the, the database, and then the blue is your page that you selected right here. So we had a really good organic reach here, but then obviously it, it went down. Same thing, the monthly viral reach and the paid reach too. Really, really interesting. So yeah, it's not tools and data like this is not perfect, but you can really identify sometimes really, you know, in, in a couple of seconds or minutes, you can see things that you may not see otherwise in just your own data. Because when you look at your Facebook page insights or post insights, you're not seeing a comparison with other pages of similar size. But this tool, and it's free, it gives you a comparison uh, with other pages at similar size. So go check it out agorapulse.com and then under free tools if you have any questions leave those questions below uh, in the comments and i will see you in the next video bye for now